Hello students, today we will discuss the topic phonetic transcription. It is all about pronunciation and the representation of that pronunciation or the sound produced while pronouncing a particular word through the set of some uh, symbols. In the exam, you will be asked to phonetically transcribe 10 words out of given 15 words. Now, let's look at what is phonetics and uh, why do we need to study phonetic transcription in our syllabus. Phonetics is the study and science of speech sounds, their production and signs used to represent them. Now, phonetic transcription is the visual representation or written form of speech sounds by means of symbols. The most commonly used phonetic transcription uses a phonetic alphabet such as the International Phonetic Alphabet, uh, the IPA. In English dictionaries, phonetic transcriptions are necessary because the spelling of an English word doesn't tell you how you should pronounce it. There is no one-to-one -one correspondence between the letters of the alphabet and the sounds they produce and thus there is difference between spelling and the pronunciation in English language. For example, there is a big difference between the spelling and the pronunciation of the word kernel. This difference between pronunciation and spelling causes a lot of confusion. Another such example is the series of the letters O-U-G-H. There are some eight different pronunciation of this series. For example, in the words enough, rough, tough, it is pronounced as of, like in the word puff in the word cuff it is pronounced like the word of in the words like drought plow it is uh, pronounced like the words how cow in the words like although do do uh, it is pronounced uh, like the words to and no are pronounced uh, in the words like bought, brought, fought, ought, sought, thought. It is pronounced like the word coat uh, and in the word like through. It is pronounced like the word true is pronounced so, to overcome this problem, the International Phonetic Association in the late 19th century devised an alphabet called International Phonetic Alphabet IPA based on the principle of strict one-to-one -one correspondence between sounds and symbols. This IPA symbols primarily uses 26 Latin alphabet and some additional symbols modified from the existing symbols and some others borrowed from the Greek. So, for the correct pronunciation of any word, we have to consult a dictionary with phonetic transcription in it. 26 English alphabet produce 44 sounds, 20 vowel sounds and 24 consonant sounds. Uh, about these sounds we will study in the next video. Thank you.